um, smoked fish cakes. Um, so this is uh, a trout that I caught today. Um, I've smoked it already and uh, as you can see I've tried some. It's absolutely beautiful. Uh, it's got some smoked paprika on there, a little bit of lime, a little bit of chilli and of course rock salt. Uh, these are mashed potatoes. I've boiled them in some uh, vegetable stock um, but it's just dry. There's no uh, butter or milk or anything else in there. That's just uh, some pretty roughed up mash spud. Uh, I've got garlic aioli here that I've made. I'm going to have the fish cakes going to be with garlic aioli. Um, and first of all for this I'm going to make a batter. So there's about half a cup of flour in there and there's about a cup of water. Just add this gradually. First egg, whole egg. You can add whatever you really like into this. You can put spring onion, you can put chilli, uh, you can put garlic, you can put red onion if you want. Um, but uh, my girls just like it plain, so uh, the trout certainly got enough flavour for everything else. I found that uh, using smoked paprika on my smoked trout really gives it a, a beautiful flavour. Um, so I'm playing around with that flavour at the moment. Right now I'm going to add the mash spud to it. So it was probably about three quarters of a cup of water that I added there. So half a cup of flour and three eggs. I'm going to cook this out, so I'll get back to you as it's near the finished product of cooking it out. Right, so it's been on the heat for about two to three minutes, everything's coming up to temperature, the eggs are cooking out, the uh, flour's solidifying, everything's come to a nice gooey mixture. Need to make sure it doesn't catch on the bottom. And we're about done. So I'll take that off the heat. I'm just going to let it cool for a few minutes. Um, I've flaked my trout. Uh, it's quite a bit of trout there, so three quarters of a trout. That was a two kilo fish. Um, I've flaked it and I'm just going to fold that through. I don't want it to be mashed into it. I still want it to have nice chunky pieces. And uh, once I'm at that stage, I'll show you what I do next. Okay, so I folded my trout, my smoked trout, through my batter mixture. And now I'm just going to spoon that into my hot oil. And it tilted it down a little bit.
I won't take too long to cook. up too full because if you do and the oil spills over and it goes on the element you've got instant fire and that is really scary so four at a time they don't take too long to cook nice and safe Alright, so there you go, all plated up, a little bit of a salad, uh, this is for my girls, a little bit of a salad, and um, yeah, deep fried smoked trout hotcakes, pretty easy to do, they come up really well, and um, yeah, with a garlic aioli, you really can't go wrong, hope you enjoy it.